is a combination of behavioral enrichment and emotional enrichment. Because I'm giving them a frozen ice block filled with all kinds of fruits and goodies for them. And so that would be an, a behavioral enrichment item. But me being here with them and socializing with them uh, is part of our emotional enrichment component. So uh, we're going to have a little of both. Uh, we're gonna, we got uh, Lucky right here. Let's see if he wants to check this out. Good boy, Lucky. Go ahead, buddy. Go ahead. Daycar and Mayotte seem to really be enjoying their blocks. They're, they're very focused on their ice blocks. Y'all enjoying that, baby? Hmm. Now, here's where uh, emotional enrichment comes into play. After playing with that for a few minutes, <coughs> Lucy would rather spend some time with me than she would with the ice block. And she says she wants to play, socialize a little bit, eat some more. That's that, Lucy. I'll go this way. Come on. Talk together. Good girl. You're my little girl, aren't you? Huh? You can get that nice flock that Lucky's got. Daycar's not going to bother you. This is Greta and Scooter. They're a year and a half year old black bears. And uh, Scooter was rescued from Alaska. Uh, Greta came from Indiana. And Scamp over here, who's two and a half, he came from uh, Alaska also. You don't leave us, Greta. play. You can see Greta would rather have the emotional interaction and visit with me than she would play with the eyes. This is where emotional enrichment and behavioral enrichment are intertwined and uh, work better together because they enjoy the interaction with their uh, human caregiver equally, if not more so, than they do their uh, behavioral item, but they, having eat both of them together enhances both. You see, uh, hi Scooter. Now Scooter's gonna spend a little time with me while Greta plays with the ice. And this is kind of how the uh, interplay of emotional and behavioral enrichment works best when they uh, kind of go from one to the other and uh, get the best of both. Hi, little girl. Better luck, he's starting to get some good stuff out of there. You don't want to let go of it now. The good part's coming. <laughs> You're a little clown, Scout. You're a little bear clown.
I swear to God. I love you too. Your attention span just goes everywhere, doesn't it, sweetheart? Oh, baby, nap time, huh? They love to touch. They love to put their hands on you. Just feel like they're touching. That's what I figured Scooter would want to do when he goes to sleep a lot of times. He'll go to sleep and lay down and put his paw up in my hand. That's why I moved over here. There goes Greta. I was going for that. You're too big for that. You can't get up in my lap. Why don't you lay down too? Go on out, baby. Go lay down to that. They don't bother though. Okay, you're gonna lay down too? Okay. Should everybody go to sleep? Now don't play with my block. Let me move my block. Okay. I'm gonna stay between you two so you won't bug each other. I said, right, go to sleep. Go to sleep, baby. Go to sleep, baby.